Hey guys, it's Tom, and um, did you just guys see that? I ranked 126 for free for all this week. Uh, I thought that was pretty sweet. Yeah, well, I guess it is Monday, but you know. I don't know, I thought it was pretty cool. I think my score for minutes, I'm like 230 or something like that. So, first blood. I love saying that, first blood. But anyway, um, as the title probably suggests, this is just two gameplays of free for all where these guys just get completely and utterly annihilated. Um, you know, I, I don't really like, you know, I don't like calling people noobs, but these guys were complete scrubs. They, they really, they were so bad. Okay, that's a pretty pathetic game, but no, seriously, these guys were horrible. <laughs> They just, they pretty much gave me these gameplays for free. Um, it w I mean, it wasn't that much, it wasn't that difficult. But, uh, yeah, so I'm using the Galil. Uh, the reason being is that I do have a contract to get 75 kills with it, I think. Um, yeah, the reason I'm using a suppressor is because I'm using a suppressor. I don't know. I don't know, the suppressor is probably the best attachment for the Galil. Uh, it's such a beast. I mean, I see people using it all the time, and it's probably the gun that pisses me off the most, but. You know, it is it is an amazing gun, but, so, you know, why not, I thought I'd just give it a try, and, um, yeah, I did win some free throws, and, yeah, this one was pretty good, and the next one, I think I also used the silence glue again, um, yeah, the reason I'm putting two videos together is because, you know, it's, it's giving me ten minutes to talk, uh, I know you're gonna be able to hear, you're gonna have to hear me, hear my voice for about ten minutes, but, you know, uh, I've got a lot to talk about, actually, I've got a lot to talk about, so, uh, yeah, um, I don't know if I'm going to upload this video, uh, sorry not this video, but uh, I have a H the HD video I was talking about in my last, uh, my last post. It's a gameplay from the new map pack, I don't know if I should upload that before I upload this one or after, I think I'll probably upload it afterwards, or I'll upload them in rapid succession anyway. Um, but yeah, um, basically the other one, I ch I've commentated on it and when I publish the file, it just completely messes up. I, I don't understand. Oh, that was a fail. I called the blackbird when there was a counter spy plane up, but yeah, I, I don't know. It just it just won't work. So I guess what I'll do is talk about when I talk talk about that. Sorry, I want to talk about what I want to talk about in that video in this video because it's a longer video. If that makes any sense, it probably makes no sense, but yeah. Uh, so I wanted to talk about the new maps because you know I did play the new maps at my friend's house. Um, I only got two or three tries. I think I played Drive-In a couple of times, and I played Hangar 18. And you know, I, I actually really enjoy them. Hangar 18, I, I got a good game. Um, I was gonna upload that again, but it didn't record. So uh, that was a shame, but it was a great. I had a lot of fun. I really enjoy having Hangar 18. Uh, I guess I'll just you know talk to you guys a bit about the maps. Um, I just see me completely shitting on these guys. <laughs> oh god, this is quite a nice move. Double Y for the win. That was quite nice. Then uh, Ghost Scrub just got completely owned. And um. Yeah, so Hangar 18 is is really nice. It's really nice and colorful. Um, I love the idea of the blackbird. It's pretty sweet. Um, um, yeah, it is a bit. It is a little bit too big. Uh, but you know, I guess you know, it, it's not too campy. I mean, people go in buildings, but it's quite easy to take them out because the buildings are quite big. So you get a lot of people there at once. There's a lot of entrances and things like that. Um, so yeah, I kind of enjoy that map. And then. Uh, Driving, it's it's pretty nice. Uh, it's not like Newtown whatsoever. Uh, it is you know it's probably half the size of the other maps, or it's at least half the size of Hangar 18. But it's nah, it's not really like uh, it's not really like Newtown. It's a little bit run down, which uh, I like having like a uh, you know a brand new environment just to completely trash in in war in warfare if you know what I mean. Like uh, a map like Cracked is already completely run down or you know destroyed, and it just gets boring playing those kind of maps. It's really you know dull. So you know maps like you know Nuketown and uh, Hazard actually that brings me on to Hazard. Uh, I check this guy out. What the hell is he doing? <laughs> He's just sitting in the cable car. I don't know. I don't blame him. He was probably hiding from the dogs. And I'm gonna skip forward to this final kill cam because I did die a few times and it's not amazing. It's a. a pretty easy 360 on a force sensitivity but yeah that was a pretty good game uh, and the next one's coming up it's a game on jungle um, I guess I'll quickly touch on that it's a uh, free for all on jungle but I'm using the FAMAS because again I have a contract to get 50 kills with the FAMAS and I'm not lying I promise you're actually gonna see I only needed four more kills and I get the contract done in a sec so believe me I, I was actually going for a contract right there um yeah, so, uh, what else? Yeah, Hazard, I really enjoy that. It's quite a big map, but, you know, it's nice and open. It's pretty good for air support, and, uh, you get a lot of ghost bitches and snipers and things like that. But, you know, all in all, it's a really bright map. I love rushing around in it. I, I played it only once, but I, I did enjoy it. 
Um, I can't really be bothered to talk about that anymore because I just really enjoy it. Uh, and then driving. I've talked about driving. Silo is the last one. Uh, I haven't played that map yet. Um, I haven't seen the gameplay from it, but I, I don't know. When they said it was going to be the biggest map, sit down, second chance. Uh, when they said it was going to be the biggest map in the game, that just completely put me off. I mean, the maps in Black Ops are already massive, it is. So, like, why would they build to make something even bigger when everyone everyone loves Nuketown? So, and they said it themselves, oh, Nuketown 24 7 was such a success. So, oh, yeah, let's put the biggest map in the game. I'm so, I don't understand that, but, you know, it's all good. It's, uh, I, don't, I don't really care because I'm not, I'm not going to buy the map packs, which, uh, yeah, that brings me on to my next point. As I, well, this is so annoying. I think, um, I was one of my black bird right here, and this guy just spawns right next to me. That was so frustrating, but... You know, I do die a couple of times. I think I go 30 and 3 in this game. Uh, I do really well. Uh, I switch to the Galil now, so... Uh, yeah, and I just start uh, completely annihilating these guys. Uh, this game was probably better because I got a lot more kills with my gun. The dogs only got like, I don't know, 4 or 5 kills because I get them, you know... Nearish the end. So, um... Yeah, it was a pretty entertaining gameplay, I think, in my opinion. These Both of these free-for-alls, and... I got them pretty much back to back because I was in the same lobby. So uh, yeah, um, starts about the maps really. Yeah, I don't buy new, ma I don't buy new map packs because you know, just let's think about it. If you're spending sixty euros on the game, you don't want to spend another sixty on the maps. I mean, in case you guys didn't know, there's going to be four. There's going to be another new map pack. Um, that's a little interesting fact that I uh, I saw that I saw on some chat forum or whatever. Uh, or some blog. Uh, the new map packs are all gonna s like the first letter of each map pack. Um, they're all gonna spell fear, just like F E A R. So you got first strike for F, and then escalation, and then you got annihilation, and you know, and then you got R. I don't know what that's gonna be. Uh, yeah, I thought that was pretty awesome, pretty cool. Um, yeah, if you guys wanna know that, you probably don't, but whatever. I just said it anyway. <laughs> but yeah, I don't even know if it's true or not, but apparently that's what it's gonna be. So um, yeah, I thought I gotta share. I thought I'd just share it with you. So. Um, yeah, that's it for the new map pack. I do enjoy it. Um, I probably won't be able to play it that much. But, uh, yeah, I guess I'm just going to touch on uh, my PVR and things. Uh, <laughs> the recording is so frustrating because I, uh, well, the HPVR, like, it saves a file which is seriously messed up. I don't know if I need to get a codec or something, which allows me to open files in Movie Maker. But right now I'm using two editing programs. I'll oh, get down, second chance. Long shot me the Python. But anyway, um,. I use another editing program called Avidimux or something, and it's really good. Uh, it lets me do everything I want, and it doesn't reduce the quality, and it doesn't let me commentate on game on the video. So that pisses me off because it's free and it's really nice. Uh, because I can't get Sony Vegas, that was a good backup, but because I can't commentate on it, then <laughs> it's a bit of a problem. So yeah, Movie Maker sucks, <laughs> but you know, at least it gets the job done. Uh, well, it doesn't. Do it doesn't really, but. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry, I need to take a sip of water. I get really thirsty doing these commentaries. Ah, alright, I'm back. That was nice. If any, if any of you guys are doing commentaries, just always drink some water, because your throat does get pretty sore after talking for like eight and a half minutes, so... Anyways, um, yeah, I know I'm sitting in the corner right here, but that's because I heard this guy on the Turtle Beach. Um, well, not Turtle Beach, sorry, my Tritons, yeah. Uh, I got a Triton headset, Triton AX180. Um, I love it. I'm using it to commentate right now. Um, I think it's pretty decent. It does buff for a little bit because it's a bit of an old headset, well, old-fashioned. But it was only 80 euros, so you know I'm not complaining. Uh, my Tele Beach X31s were second-hand, and the mic broke after about I don't know a month and a bit, two months. So <laughs> yeah, that was a bit annoying. But you know I'm pretty happy with my Tritons. I'd recommend these headset because it's cheap and it really does a job. Um, the only problem is it has a lot of wires, so uh, watch out for that. And see, right here, I'm playing really well. Uh, I'm really making good decisions when I got the black butt up. You know, I'm going for the easy people. And uh, yeah, it's only like five kills left, so the dogs get like two or three of them. Um, so it was a really good game. Uh, I went in about like six minutes or so, and I went the other one in like, I don't know, four or five minutes. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the duel episode. Um, my doggy's gonna get the final kill count. Uh, so yeah, if you enjoyed it, go ahead and thumbs it up. Please leave a like. Um, it really, really does help me out. Um, I've been getting more likes on my videos, but, you know. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And, um, as always, just leave a like rating. Uh, leave a comment, any subscriber requests. But, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye.